Hi, I'm John Twist of University Motors. Today is oh, sometime in July 2015, the 10th maybe, and we're looking forward to our summer party in August. So if you haven't already taken a look on our website, look there, look at the registration form and come to our summer party, the MG Summer Party Reunion, MG Summer Party Reunion. Hey, today I want to talk about a fuel supply, fuel supply to HIF carburetors. HIF carburetors used in the United States models from 1972 through uh, 1974. So they've got a needle and seat inside them. I'm speaking loud. We've got an airport next door and these planes take off all day, which I never hear until I make in a video. Anyway, the fuel supply comes in from the front and then passes through, goes through, through this tube and feeds the rear. And if there is any dirt, any anything in here, these carburetors will overflow. They love to overflow. HIF carburetors love to overflow a lot more than the HS carburetors. Now the HS carburetors have got the float bowl on the side, so if they're overflowing, three screws in the top, you take the you take the lid off, you look in it, you fiddle around with it, easy, easy as pie. These horrible. You got to take them off the car to service them. So you take them off the car, you get the, you get the nice Viton tip needles and seats, you put those in, you put it all back together, a minute later, an hour later, a week later, a month later, overflowing again, and you're going, what am I doing wrong? The fuel lines, the fuel lines come apart on the inside, and little tiny, tiny, tiny pieces of black rubber past the fuel filter, float down into here and get caught in the needle and seat. So you can change the line from the fuel filter to here, that's easy enough. And you can change the line from here to here with just a piece of quarter inch fuel line and put, put clamps on it. Well, done. But what happens if you're Mr. Original and you want to make it look nice? Now you can order a new piece of hose, absolutely, that's got this nice steel mesh on it. Or, or you can do this. So we're going to take this guy off and take this. Got some American hose clamp on it here. Take him off. Better to use a, a nut driver on these eighth-inch nut driver. So, okay. Now this guy is like a Chinese finger puzzle, and if we if we can push him. We can expand him, and the hose comes right out. So what your job then is to do is get a new piece of hose, and you want to get the Gates green hose. Now everybody's on this friggin' green bandwagon, so they got green thread through the hose. What's green about the hose? Well, you know, in fact, the green hose that Gates makes they've tested and let's say that you get a foot long piece of this and you keep it under slight pressure for a year the question is how much gasoline gets through the hose and evaporates okay? and then you take your green hose and do the same thing to it the green hose loses 10 percent of what a normal hose does so by the gates green hose it, it it loses less gasoline over a period of time better hose Anyway, so you take this piece of hose, this guy here, it's hard to clean him up. If you put him on the wire wheel when he's on, on the hose, it just tears him up. Can you glass bead him a little bit? Sure, again on the hose. Sometimes it helps if you put some, some uh, oil on the hose. So we'll put a little bit of oil in here. All mechanical things love oil. some oil on here, display the ends. And like a Chinese finger puzzle, you can get this thing back down in there, pull him straight. Now the ends are all splayed out, these ends. And if you try to take this end and put it over this, it will not go. It just won't, you can be there all day. So what I do is take some carburetor cleaner spray the end of it, take some black electrical tape, just PVC electrical tape, put a band or two of it around there, put some grease or oil inside that, then you can press this on. 
and put the original clamp back on. And then when you put it back together, it looks original. If originality is a is a function to you, because everything is is everything is a combination of form and function. So obviously you want the function, but a lot of people want the form. They want it to look nice, look make it look original. So that's how we do it. So hey, come to our summer party. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for some redos of some of our earliest videos with this new, I was going to say kick ass, but that's an incorrect word to use in public, so I won't, uh, camera that Dayton has. So anyway, hey, till later, safety fast.